welcome to vlog number four. Just a hard day at work sitting here checking out some of the new sets. An ice cream store, a Waffle House, a Walmart, an arcade. In fact, you know what? I need some paper towels. Yeah, because I'm out of paper towels, so. Had to, uh, oops, run by Walmart and grab some paper towels. I gotta pay for that. So while I ring these up, how about you guys watch vlog number four? <laughs> going to be a little different than usual. It's going to have your same recipe of the cool stuff as always. Mm. Voila! Just like it does on eBay, folks. The magic of Chick-fil-A. This is our most popular restaurant set. And you know why? Probably because of lemonade. People love lemonade. Zabadak had a few too many lemonades in the Walmart video, didn't he? Heading to change clothes and go to the studio to film. So today what we're gonna do, we've gotten so many questions from viewers wanting to know how in the world I get myself into the Lego set. I'm like a shopper right now. Just picking uh, some cool little things that you guys have told me you want to see in the Target. Just looking through, seeing what we got. Got a couple of carts there. This is gonna be epic. Got a camera sitting there, the bike over there. I put more briefcases there. Chairs there, trash cans there. Hey, Brick Addicts. Today, we're coming to you from the Target store. So now, all I gotta do is tweak it and perfect it. It'll be awesome. A couple of people asked if we sell on BrickLink or not. No, we don't. And the reason is because we got so many custom sets and we sell so many custom sets that, here's an example. Say we sold on BrickLink and had an order for these. Well, you know, as the uh, law of, laws of life would uh, have it, I'm sure we would need those like the same day after we got the brick link order and we'd be out ourselves and not able to ship our things. So uh, that's why we don't sell on brick link. My quick little words of wisdom in the target video did pretty good and was well uh, received, which wasn't necessarily my intentions to even throw that out there. I just kind of felt the need to. Now, as many of you probably don't know, I've been uh, developing businesses for over 20 years now. So I've been lucky and fortunate enough to have um, quite a successful track record. I've also done motivational speaking, things like that. I've got an interest in doing that on YouTube, but I don't necessarily know where that fits in with Legos. I need your help with this. You know, I don't want any kind of motivational stuff that goes in with the Legos to feel like it's contrived. It's all gonna have to come from here. So even if I do add things like that into the Lego stuff anywhere, um, it's gotta be something that I'm feeling at the moment. If I do something like that, would it be something that you, the viewer, would rather see maybe words of wisdom at the end of uh, some of the episodes uh, maybe once a week, a particular show. Comment below. Let me know your opinion on that. I'm so scared right now. I've got myself in her hands I'm a great on a test drive of her awesome new car. 
She's our main sticker designer, so she deserves my attention. Voila! Hey, Brick Addicts! Today, we're coming to you from the Target store. I got my friends Brad, his son Evan's already in the store shopping. I've got Daryl from Bevan's Bricks and Zabadak. And we're going to have some fun. We're going to take you on a tour of the new Lego Brick Attic Target. You're going to like this.